it is done. Can I go and see my mother now? Only the Grand Inquisitor may say. But you told me. My words are of no importance. Only those of the Grand Inquisitor. But be sure, you are very precious to him indeed. In a row, I've been on Episangri's duty. When's it gonna end, eh? Soon. The hour of the conjuration approaches. But think of Vitalis. People. Your ordeal is nothing compared to his. How has today's refining gone? The quality is excellent, but the mass of raw episanguis is decreasing. Our harvesters are being decimated by the rats. Do your best. The life of the Grand Inquisitor depends on the quality of the distillate. Grand Inquisitor is overwhelmed by the might. I fear it will now attack his mind. Don't worry. The boy's blood will restore the powers of equilibrium. May his soul emerge unstained. I think. necessary to change the filters and scrape the tanks. reached the objective. I hope so. Because that's all we'll be able to produce. It is already a miracle that Vitali's body can take such quantities of empty sacks. Afraid. Not afraid. The city during the conjuration. You on the list? Yeah. I'll be on the square in front of the cathedral. Oh, so you'll be right next to the Grand Inquisitor when he frees us. And I'll be stuck here. We'll all meet again afterwards. The end of the bite. It's going to be quite a party. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Sang with steam. I'm not blind from this. I know I am. Damn it. Now, the Grand Inquisitor is very busy. Busy? I am the Archbishop. I represent the Pope. Monseigneur, the mission of the Grand Inquisitor is sacred. His mission was never approved by the Church. I see here only heresy and occultism. And you, you all follow him on this infernal road. Measure your words, Excellency. Your rank should make you more cautious. <sighs> Madness! Don't listen to them. The most important thing is mommy. <clears throat> My head. Sh shut up! <clears throat> Magister, the text clearly mentions the ascension of a child during the Great Plague of Justinian. I knew it. The Roman nobles isolated him from the people and worshipped him in secret. Maybe an ancestor of Hugo de Rune. Continue. They're talking about me. By freeing the country from the bite, the Grand Inquisitor will gain the adoration of the people, and with it, unprecedented political power. Archbishop Gautier's presence here says a lot. The Pope's court is worried, and so they should be. Serves them right for not intervening earlier. The Prima Macula, on the cusp of the first threshold, devours the lost carrier, or walks beside the one who tames it, master or slave, order or chaos. The Etruscan research sure? texts are all coded. I give up. I have some good news. They finally moved her to the basement. So she's going to crack. About time. 
Mami. You see, Amicia, I found Mummy. She's in the basement, they said. I have to keep going down. Grand Inquisitor, the Archbishop has arrived. Perfect. Bring him in. Vitalis. Monseigneur Gautier, I trust your journey went well. Now spare me your niceties. We grow tired of your little game, Vitalis. A game, Archbishop? <laughs> Can a game change the future of the world? Listen to yourself. You have completely lost your mind. And all this is... If I may, it's important. We have the blood of Hugo de Rune. Have you tested it? Yes. Uh, alas, Monseigneur. The boy should have reached the first threshold already, but it seems something in his blood has slowed the process. The macula is still in its original state. No matter. If the books are correct, my blood and his will be bound. When he reaches the next threshold, I shall reach it with him. Proceed. That's enough. You play the martyr. But allow me to tell you the truth. You are a vile heretic driven mad by power. The Pope considers you a threat. Vitalis Benevon, you are to be excommunicated. One can excommunicate a man, Archbishop. <laughs> but not a saint. You're Inquisition is over. Meaning that a new era commences. One where puppets such as yourself will kneel and beg me to save them. He is with us. Very good. Go and see whether Beatrice Doreen has regained consciousness. Same goal. We both fight the plague. Only our methods differ. The daughter is making the same error. <sighs> Stupid. But the brother, he is unique. He might understand. Unique? I'm unique. At ease. Ad ignem. Ad lucem, sir. So, you saw the Grand Inquisitor? Yes. 
The blood of the carrier flows through his veins. The conjuration will take place. Splendid. The end of the plague is nigh. Indeed. But do not lower your guard. We've been after him for weeks, and then he simply turns up here asking to see his mother. Huh. It seems he has a sense of humor that he won't be keeping for long. I have to go and see his mother myself. What's he going to do with her? I was told that the carrier of the macula is here. Is that right? The child turned himself in this morning. Apparently there was a disagreement. As I was telling you, this guard was devoured, but not completely. His bones were cut up and taken away by the rats. For what purpose? To incorporate them into that material we find everywhere. You mean their nests? They use our dead to build their nests. Precisely. And if we do nothing, at the rate the dead are accumulating, the nests will eventually join together to form one giant nest. Just a matter of time. Don't let us pray. Let the Dalek conduit in Solomon's rats. Where is he? I want why can't I hear you like the others? Help me! No! Help me! What's wrong with him now? Hey! No. Die quietly! We're trying to work here! I'd rather he wait and be quiet. Rats prefer fresh meat. Damn you! You'll all go to hell! You, you and your fucking rats! Savor this respite. He's going to get mommy. Your death mm. is not an end, for your blood shall nourish a new race of angels. They shall be your children, your pride. It's horrible. If 
She sees her son with a knife to his throat. She'll go for it. So Lord Nicholas go past. That the rune woman is gonna suffer, I'd say. Uh, serves her right. Uh, such an educated woman. She should have joined our side. Oh, she's way too tough. But no match for our torture. She must be near here. Ah, please. At least let me die out there. You wouldn't like it out there, believe me. At least here, your carcass can still be of value to our alchemists. Think yourself lucky. Oh, you bastard. Hey, kid. What the hell are you doing here? Shh. I have to find my mommy. The alchemist. Oh, goodness. You should have... You to me. For the last time, will you answer my questions? Or perhaps you are still upset about what happened to your husband. Right. Our torturer will take care of you. You'll soon have your voice back. Mark my words. Oh no, he's coming back. But... so they... Amicia said you were dead, but you're not. Amicia... My darling... You must go... if they find you here. No, I'm staying with you. Oh, Hugo... Did they take your blood? Oh my god... All right, Hugo, we'll go together, but you have to find the keys. They must keep them in the room at the end of the corridor. Can you make it there? Off you go then, go. Be very careful. Come back as soon as you have the keys. When I return, I want everything prepared and ready to begin. Do you understand? Yes, Lord Nicholas. All right, you heard him. Everything will be ready. The alchemist will talk. I'm going to enjoy it. Just do your job. The captain of the guard doesn't appreciate improvisation, and neither do I. Uh, yes, of course. Let me know when you're ready. I have to meet the lady. Right. This might give me a promotion. Authority, results. I thought you has to be efficient. Not the rune no woman has a so a real lady. So soft. Anyway, the knives are sharpened. Hammer, pliers, fiber, and sword. Everything is ready. Have I forgotten anything? Hmm. Maybe kept in around the double check.
Come on. <clears throat> quick, quick. The gate's broke. Shit, we need to go. Move, move. Hold on. Go away. Quickly now. The key. Lanterns. Oh, it works. Shoo. Ah, uh, don't look. Don't look. Yes. See me, sir. I'm just going to... by myself. It's all right. Shh. No one will hurt you now. My hero. How do you feel? Your head. It... it talks to me. All the time now. And what does it say? It says... it wants me to join it. The first threshold. Tommy, I'm scared. We'll never get out of here. We don't have a choice. If I am with you, the voice, are you ready to reply? Hugo, can you hear them? Mm, yes. They all have the same voice. The one that makes my head hurt. Don't try to ignore it. Embrace it completely. Don't be afraid. Yes. <laughs> Everything is all right. Now. You're going to tell them to move, so we can get out. Well done. You see? My headache's gone. It was the macula, but you answered it. Let's get going. Those screams. They must have let rats loose on the prisoners again. Come on. Find this document and get out of here. You big coward. You're scared, aren't you? Oh, Hugo, this is not a game. 
This power is dangerous. You have to control yourself. Yes, Mummy. So, that's my disease. You're not sick, Hugo. It's a... It's a gift. I'll explain later. A gift? Ah! You found her! Oh. Oh, maybe I'm going crazy. Ages. Be careful. Ah, rats! Rat! Black rat! Fuck! Help! Well done. These rats. What the hell did they do to them? They make them eat people's blood. Really? Yes. It's strange. I can feel the black rats, but... Not these ones. I see. We need to find a way to get out of here. What are they going to do with these rats? to explain. But Amicia doesn't know. No. I'll explain later. We had an argument, Mommy. It's all right, my darling. Let's get out of here, huh? So, Beatrice, you are reunited with your son at last. I know what you have done to him. You have taken what you wanted, now let him go. Oh, you insult me, Madame de Rune. Your son is the natural carrier of the macula. And it has not yet finished with him. Which means, neither have I. But this you know. Vitalis, let us finish this. Nicolas, you cannot understand. You feel it as I do. Do you not, boy? We are bound by blood now. What do you think, Hugo? Your family grows larger, huh? I beg of you. I promise to help you, but allow my son to leave. His destiny is not 
to be a Darun. His destiny is to be here, at my side. You are a monster. A monster? Madame, you have yet to see just how. the threshold as we'd hoped. Do you know why? Amicia. It's Amicia. How tiresome. But he's close now. And we have other pawns we can play. Take her away. Leave him alone. What else do you want? <laughs> A lot more. So much more. And you will stay here with me, to make sure we get it. Do not worry, Hugo. I have complete faith in you. We shall succeed. She's awake! Stay calm, Amicia. You go. Shh. Arthur and I tracked you down, but... You disappeared for three days, Amicia. You almost died. We were so worried. You go. Leave me alone. Dreaming. The others must be up. The rats will be coming. We need to light the fires. Oh, I want it. Oh, come on! Please open, will you? I think Roderick is working in the yard. Is the lock still frozen? Oh, uh, yes. It's a tough winter this year. Anyway, how was your nap? Feeling better? A little. Did you dream of him again? Yes. I'm going to prepare a special brew of St. John's Wort for you. That's all right, Lucas. I don't need it. I miss him, that's all. I have to accept that he won't be coming back. Amicia, you're going to be all right? <sighs> I'm going to go see the others. Oh, can you tell Melly about the chest? Of course. 
Mel is going to say something like, you should just piss on it. But it's way too cold for that. Oh, I can't feel my fingers. Oh, what are you doing here? Hugo should have found you. This should make things a little easier. We've never had so many apples. Hugo would have made himself sick with them. And I want to stay here. Oh, really? And what if... What if, what if, what if you stopped living like an animal? Oh, um, hello, Amicia. Hey, sorry, am I interrupting? Uh, no. Arthur was just saying he wants to leave. Again. Come on! I want us to stay alive, that's all. Like we've always done. Listen, it'll be dark soon and we have to light the fires. Can you help me, Arthur? Go on. Try not to annoy the hell out of her. Um, why would I do that? Because you're a pain in the ass, that's why. Oh, Lucas needs help with his chest. Yeah, right. He just wants to see me, that's all. Oh. All right. Ready when you are, Amicia. Come on, let's get the braziers in place, starting with... That one. Yes, I know. We've been doing the same routine for weeks, Amicia. I'm sorry, it just helps me sleep better knowing the pit is secure at night. So, um, what's up? I feel old. You look pretty good for an old person. <laughs> Thank you. Listen, I don't know your brother that well, but... He would like you. Really? You saved us. You were captured, you managed to escape. <laughs> You're like a hero from a book or something. A hero. But he would have been sad to see you leave. Ah. There you go. <laughs> you really like your ignifer, don't you? I have a thing for fire. All right, if you say so. Is everything all right, Roderick? Everything's fine. This damn thing is going to work. Hey, calm down. If you break everything... <laughs> ah, and there you go. Now the braziers will stay put. The Roderick method. Random, but effective. <laughs> Try it. I intend to. Right. You take that one? I'll look after the other brazier. Whenever hey, you're ready. Are you alright? Uh yes. Why? That was pretty uh, intense. Oh, the kicking, you mean? My father was like that. I'm just carrying on the tradition now he's um anyway. How about you? Oh I'm alright. I miss the kid too. Hey, you know what? We could always extend the search area. Roderick. There's no point. It's been a month already. Let's... let's just get the pit ready for the night. All right. Arthur wants you all to himself, is that it? Just shut it, will you? Dearest Amicia, allow this forlorn brigand to steal thy heart. <laughs> Go take a bath. You stink. <laughs> How sweet a minstrel thou makest. Let's go, and make sure the brazier is right up to the edge. Nobody's going to be able to climb out of that pit. The system is here for a reason. The system won't stop trained soldiers. Arthur, Melly is tired of running. 
Melly and I are not people like you. But perhaps Melly isn't like you either. All right, I get it. Handle the brazier on the ramparts. I'll handle these ones. that we have something here and we need people like you to keep it safe let me think about it Right, I finished. Something wrong? I'll open a way for you on my side. I 
thought you said this bike was secure. Yeah, it used to be. This is good. This is not good. I have to get to the ladder in the red area, or I'll die here. Amicia, I'll get a brazier your way. Try to reach it. All right, I'm counting on you. We'd never make it. Are you all right? Yes, thanks. It's up to you now. The brazier on your side. I'll get you there. How are you doing? All right. I prefer being here than down there. What the hell is going on, Amicia? <sighs> they tried to get in before, but never like that. How come? How do I know? But it was almost like they were attacking. Oh, come mm -hmm. on. They're rats, not the English army. But they know Shit. what they're doing. I've only seen this once before. At home. At the domain. I hope they're all right. If the rats have got in... Amicia, they're not kids anymore. They're used to it. I don't want to take any more risks. I'm not going to lose anyone else. What I'd really like is to be as far away from here as possible. Well, I'm not a magician, huh? Did you get bitten? No. We have to get out of here. But the castle was made to resist. Lucas, there were never so many before. This is not a simple infestation. What the hell is it then? This way! Quickly! Go and do what has 
to be done. Hugo. Come on. Hugo. It was Ellie, what, what are you doing it with was the door? Hugo. It, it was Fudge. What have Get they done the to way. him? The rats. He, he, he was. He can control them. Yes, there you the go. macula. Where does that go? Don't panic. The castle was designed for this kind of situation. Your castle's falling apart. The vats are getting through the defenses like a hot knife through butter. Listen, I have to talk to Hugo. I can... We have to get out of here. Demetia, he's right. Go through. No, no. Get to work. Hugo! Hugo! Kill her! Or I will kill your mother in front of you. Hugo! It's me! Amicia! Your sister! Kill her, child! Maybe Vitalis will keep you by his side. Hugo, no! Go on, child! She means nothing to you now. They're looking for you everywhere! What are you waiting for? Cross the damn threshold, carrier! Don't listen to him, Hugo! Enough! I'll let your rats have her. Don't touch him, you bastard! Bastard! He gave himself up because you betrayed him! Thanks to him, Vitalis will soon be the sole carrier of the Machina! What? No! Hugo is the only carrier! What? Blood now flows through the veins of the Grand Inquisitor! Oh, no! Die! Oh, oh, no! We got that bastard! Amicia. Go make sure he's dead. I have to... I have to speak to Hugo. Go ahead. I'll take care of him. Hugo? Hugo! I just want to talk to you. He can't hurt you anymore, Hugo. Look! All right. I won't move. You come here. Come on. You lied to me. No. No. I... Hugo. I was trying to protect you. I... I...
not easy to live in the carry. Stop it, please! I'll kill them all! I'll burn their fucking banner! Millie, you'll never make it! What about you? You're just gonna stand there! Just wake up! Look! You don't know what you're saying! I do know we're getting killed! One by one! They got my brother! Your father! Yours! There's nothing left! Nothing! She's right. Peace here. This is crazy. Five of us. Against... Against an army. I think there are a lot more of us now. Has... Has he passed the threshold? Yes. I believe so. Hugo, what do you want to do? I want to save Mommy. That changes a lot of things. Even if it kills us, what have we got to lose? Us? Nothing. But Vitalis. Now we can stop him. So let's go. To the death. To the, to death. the death. 